Here's a little short about my first experiment mixing salt water using rainwater as the source. So now I'm going to do a water change using good old fashioned rainwater and some of my Red Sea Coral Pro Sea Salt. First step one, fill the bucket freshly caught rainwater. And some of my Red Sea Coral Pro Sea Salt. First, I add some, a little bit of water. I'm gonna add some of my Red Sea salt here. My measuring cup, one, two, three. Then I'll take some of my fresh caught rainwater, a little rainwater system there. <laughs> the rain barrel here and my fresh rain system there why waste any of it give it a good stir Best thing about this is I know I don't have to use any tap water treatment. I'm not running my RO, I'm not wasting any water. And another good thing about the Red Sea Coral Pro Salt is it dissolves very, very quickly. Got my little hydrometer there. Good reading, add a little more salt. Add a little more water. Stir it up a little bit more. All right, get that one more test. And we're right at 1.022, 1.023. One point oh two three. That's how I do my rainwater water change. Well, if you've stuck around this long and haven't seen me blow myself to smithereens, consider clicking that subscribe button because I definitely appreciate it. So this way I can bring you more content like this experiment and other things to help us all understand what makes this hobby tick and make it simpler for everybody as well as ways to save money and keep these animals going happy and healthy in the process. I did manage to even get the temperature down to about a 77 degrees which I wanted to cool it off it was getting warm and everything seems to be running very well so I hope you're following thank you for watching and stay tuned to see how this affects the tanks going forward so until next time this is D from Brooklyn keeping my sanity by keeping aquariums thank you everybody